what should be private. Our personal information. Our rooms. Using the bathroom. Our post. Our phone calls. Our relationships. Privacy is a fundamental aspect of maintaining dignity. For each individual, privacy is a major part of dignity in social care. It's ensuring that the person has a knowledge that no one will intrude in their personal space or their rooms or any of their belongings without explicit permission from the person. People have the right to open their own mail. Both Matthew and James check every day to see if there's posts been. They come in and they split it up into who's post to. They open that post and they always show staff what post they've got. Staff sign it and date it. And then we'll just take the action that needs to be taken from whatever post it is. Personal information should only be shared on a need to know basis. When we're thinking about confidentiality, we preserve that by retaining the documents in a safe place. And obviously anything that we disclose is on a need to know basis. We're very careful who we give information to. Relatives don't necessarily have the right to have information about the people we care for. It really is up to them to decide who we disclose information to and how much of that information is disclosed. When the phone rings, Matthew or James will answer the phone. We don't answer the phone, it's not our house. And if they need support with the phone call, they just come in and ask staff to support them with the phone call. Oh, hello, Red. But sometimes it's their friends are ringing up for a chat or parents ring up for a chat. But normally if they need support, they'll come to us with the phone and see that they need us to speak to this person. Hey, girls. I don't not too bad. When helping people, offer the maximum amount of privacy possible. If it's safe to do so, I always think it's nice to let people be in the bathroom for a little while on their own. And if you're a little bit worried, you could maybe just stand on the other side of the door. But I think letting people be alone in the bathroom a little while is nice. If you're supporting somebody in the bathroom, um, they might need support to be actually supported onto the toilet. But they don't need you to be there while they're doing whatever they need to do. Um, so you can just wait outside and if they're able to tell you that they're then ready for you to go back in again. And it's just those little examples that probably are quite easy to forget and you've just got to have it built into the ethos of, of where you are. People are entitled to have private and intimate relationships. Staff should ensure any risk is minimised. Anybody can have a relationship, that's fine, that's entirely up to them. All the staff have got to um, respect the residents to make their decisions. Privacy can be everything from making sure that someone's um, dignity is preserved, not interfering in their day-to-day -day activities, and if they have a guest, to give them space to enjoy that conversation without being present, to give them um, opportunity to live their life in a dignified and private way, as we would all want. Having private space is really important. Right, this is my bedroom. This is my private bedroom I've got in here. My family photos, my DVD standard, your castle frames, one, di one direction poster. I've got my room decorated. I choose blue. I feel, I feel, I feel confident with it. Matthew does his own washing and then he'll take it up into his bedroom and he just tangs it all up on his own. We never go in their bedrooms and invite it to their space. We have privacy in our lives and this is their home 
in their their bedrooms or their own private space. I wouldn't want people walking through my bedroom, the same as they don't want us walking through their bedroom. We'll always knock on the door and they'll either ask what to go in or they'll come to the door to see what we want. Everybody's room is um, personalised to each resident and also they've got in their own suite bathrooms. So they've got the privacy of using their own toilets. Got the most immaculate photograph I've ever seen. Privacy is things like knocking on doors, asking somebody, would you like me to give you privacy at the moment? You know, let me know when you're ready for me to come back and support you some more. It's just that kind of thing, really. It's just it's very basic stuff. 